The second part of this experiment involves an atmospheric pressure distillation and how to assemble the apparatus I will show you in this video. This time we need two retort stands and in the normal fashion we will assemble it with bosses and clamps, make sure that the opening of the bosses points upwards again and take notice that on the second, the right retort stand, when you assemble the clamp, you assemble it in a fashion that the claw that moves points upwards and that the other claw that doesn't move is at the lower side, in which way we make sure that the condenser, which is shown here, rests easily on the apparatus. The next important piece of equipment is the so-called pick, which allows us to collect different fractions. You have privet those round bottom flasks that you put on. And you will secure all round bottom flasks with yellow joint clips, which prevents them from falling down. Once you have done that, you can see that the round bottom flask sits tightly and now we have to affix it to our condenser in a fashion that it can be turned, as is shown here, but doesn't fall off. On the left retort stand, we assemble now our round bottom flask and on top of that goes the so-called still head. Now it has to be assembled in a parallel fashion so that the still heads can be attached to the condenser easily. Once you have aligned the whole apparatus, you just open the clamp on the condenser and slide the condenser over the joint of the still head. Then you fix the clamp again and that fix the still heads to the condenser using a yellow joint clip. What remains is to attach the rubber tubing on the outlet and on the inlet and you fix it again using a jubilee clip as shown here. So this one is the water outlet and you repeat the same for the water inlet on the lower part of the condenser. Once the whole apparatus is set up you can use a funnel to fill in some anti-bumping granules and finally the solution which you want to separate using the atmospheric pressure distillation. Take care that you can fill in that nothing flows down the condenser, that the solution just goes into the round bottom flask. Carefully remove the funnel and finally carefully put the thermometer on top of the still head and fix it with a yellow joint clip. Before you start the distillation ensure that the still head sits tightly on the round bottom flask and there is no leak in between.